British Columbia's largest event, it's Vancouver's premier music festival, and it's a sure sign that summer is in full swing. The 27th annual TD Vancouver International Jazz Festival is back this year from June 22nd to July 1st, and it's going to be even bigger and better than ever before. So what can we look forward to this year? Well, I'm here today at the Jazz Festival's media launch for a really big announcement about new initiatives and collaborations. So let's go see what it's all about. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm John Orsic, Media Director for the TD Vancouver International Jazz Festival. And I'm one of the founders of this event, along with Artistic Director Ken Pickering. <laughs> and the wind cried. <laughs> well, we're off to a uh, rousing start here. Anyway, while uh, Eduardo and Rob do the uh, choreography, I'm going to be your host uh, for today's event, and I'm delighted that uh, you're able to join us for this uh, very special announcement today. So now, let's get to it. I'd like to invite Executive Director of Coastal Jazz and Blues Society and the TD Vancouver International Jazz Festival, Fatima Amarji, to share some great news with you. Thank you, John. Hello, everybody. We are proud to announce today that with the support of the City of Vancouver and the Province of British Columbia, we will be relocating the opening weekend of the TD Vancouver International Jazz Festival from Gastown to downtown. On June 23rd and 24th, the Jazz Festival will host Downtown Jazz, a free art and music village right here on the grounds of the Vancouver Art Gallery and Robson Square. Featuring three stages of live performance, and there's a map over there for anybody who cares to have a look. The first stage will be located on the Georgia side of the bag. The second will be right here on the corner of Robson and Hornby Streets. And the third will be at the ice rink level of Robson Square. Well, I just heard the big announcement for the new home of the opening weekend. Um, I know you said you were really inspired about the feeling of the Olympics. What made you want to bring that to the Jazz Festival? Well, I think we really wanted to build off the Olympics, the spirit, but we've always wanted to be in the heart of the city. The festival is such a huge event and, a, and an event that engages so many people here. And to make it more accessible, more visible, I think is the next step for the growth of the festival and also I think an important part in the evolution of the city of Vancouver. We're also thrilled to present in conjunction with the New Forms Festival, you'll remember these folks they produced the Code Live project for the Olympics, an interactive motion activated experience involving ambient jazz music, abstract photography and movement located inside the Vancouver Art Gallery called Play Jazz. An arts and cultural community fair, artisan market, food market, free dance classes, busker entertainment, and last but not least, two, count that, two licensed outdoor bistros where music lovers can enjoy a great beer or a glass of wine with a show. We'll round out the remainder of our activities on the site. All the new activities, beer gardens, activities for kids, what are you looking forward to the most? I think the sound garden is going to be really cool. I've heard about these, I've seen them where there's sounds that uh, kids and maybe some adults like myself play with and, and I really love interactive art. Uh, I mean the jazz itself is obviously going to be magnificent, but the interactive things where people can play with music and learn how to change things and decide that maybe it's fun to make music and I would love the idea of somebody coming here for the weekend playing with the interactive sound garden and going home, or sound playground, and going home and deciding that they might actually want to do more with music in their lives. Great, well thank you so much for speaking with us. I can't wait till the opening weekend. I know, me too. I'm a singer. I'm going to be bebopping along in the back. I'll see you there. <laughs> Bye. Now I know this 
City can't be more excited for the new home of the opening weekend for the 27th annual TD Vancouver International Jazz Festival. So come join us for one very big celebration from June 22nd to July 1st. For more information, you can check out www.coastaljazz.ca. For Novus TV, I'm Christina Meng.